So, um, I have different hair than I have in the clips. I have my wig on, and I'm super chilling. Um, but you're gonna have a day with me in the mall. Um, I took the team out who has also turned into family for me. Um, but it's Shamika, Jalen, Tiffany, and Crystal. And um, we're going makeup shopping. I need makeup. Um, I'm getting pretty good with my eyebrows, and you're gonna see who's been teaching me. So, here it is. What are you doing today? Today I'm trying on makeup. Here's Shamika, Chris, and Jalen. And um, oh, I did my eyebrows today, and I'm usually terrible at it. But Chris coached me, and she helped me to find a very easy technique, which was to use this pencil. Where's the pencil? It's by Anastasia. But Chris corrected me, and um, yes, I want that. Is that what this is gonna do? Yes. Um, she told me to get Anastasia. 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 Asha. How old were you when you started wearing makeup? I think I was like 14. 14. 15. We tried on Monday. I'm not sure. What's your absolute must-have in Sephora? Um, Sephora? I've got to put to... Oh, my God. That's about it. That looks amazing. Your haircut is fabulous. Thank you. Hi, are we so serious? Look at your eyebrows, honey. Thank you so much. I love your hair. I love Thank you. Hair. Thank you. Okay. So let's try this under here. That's Shamika's birthmark. She hates it, but I love it. I hate it so much. What? What? And we, we tried, we're trying everything. Jalen put the mask on his face. Doesn't look like it put much of anything out. How do you feel, Jalen? Um, oh, I'm going to clean this off. About three shades. Yes, lighter. honey. Yes. She likes to go a shade lighter. Yes. It looks like a trying dummy. to put me in a cat kit. No. I'm going to be so illuminated, sister. Feel it. This side versus this side. Oh, wow. It does look Feel I don't feel like nothing. You didn't touch this side. She don't say that. I feel like my granny. Good job, Jalen. It's right. It's a little light. She said she tried the next one up on you. That looks good. It does look good. What? You don't want it to be like raccoon. Well, what's going to tone it down so that I'm not looking like like a light light skin. Like I want to be light skin. No. I contour while I'll tone it down. Mm -hmm. She wants it like blends into it and I haven't really blended it out all the way. It'll get a So that was really fun and um, NARS, you see NARS, I'll show you NARS. Should I show? No, you can just Google it, yeah? Google queens, Google kings. Um, I like to have fun, I like to play in makeup. One of the reasons why I've had to learn how to make myself up and be consistent, um, I mean, I look at some of my biggest inspirations, like, um, great example, Beyonce, she's always consistent. Hair is always glamorous, face is always bead, gorgeous skin, still working on my skin. Um, my mommy, she's always gorgeous, she's beautiful. Um, and then, he's a male, but my father, he is a, an incredible leader. And um, one thing that I've noticed about him is that he's very polished, he's always keeping himself up. Um, one thing that I've learned is that your appearance should say something about your future, who you are, and um, where you're headed. So I want to be consistent with that, and I don't want to always pay for a makeup artist for the dates, because I'm literally gone like every week. And so if I'm gone every week, that means I'll probably be spending like, and then I'll, well, if I'm gone every week, and I'm doing more than one show, so that's about three to five hundred dollars a week. And I'm really working on budgeting. We'll talk about that in the next episode. Um, but I'm super chilling in this interview, so don't judge how I look. Um, but uh, 
yeah so this is why I've been really wanting to work on how I beat my face um, so that you know y'all not like oh she looks gorgeous when this person does her face I just want to just be pretty all the time I mean I'm pretty with it or without it um, it just enhances my beauty let's say it that way so this is why I wanted to one other funny thing is um, I don't I think Shamika started it but we all call each other fat self get your fat self Yo, and I don't know if we do, I don't know why we do it, but while we were out to eat, um, somebody or like, or or Okay, okay. Obviously, I have a stuttering problem. I'm not going to speak that over my life. I have a speech situation. It's not a problem. It's just, I need to slow down. My mind is going faster than my mouth can speak. So, slow down. Anyways, you're getting ready to see us continuously calling each other fat self. Unacceptable. But, we're owning it. Um, we eat good. I eat healthy. Um, some other people eat cupcakes and hot chips. Um, they may be in the film here, so we'll see. They fat too! No, we don't mean any harm. It's just fun amongst us. We wouldn't dare call someone else fat so. But we do, um, honor a plate that is overloaded and it is just like ridiculous as fat self. So, enjoy. This is catching Kiara. <laughs> you had the camera all foggy on me, and it I look good. like it's your YouTube channel. Oh, the fat self. Fat self. <laughs> oh no, that's fat self. <laughs> no, that's fat self. Oh, that's fat self. I can't believe this girl is standing like this. <laughs> it was this long. Oh, You're never that hungry. Finish. Wait, I have to show them something. Look at this makeup and see her hair. Oh. 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 Where is it? Oh. Did you get it? No, it's there. You see it? It's like a little bit so that it doesn't show all that much. Yeah. Oh, Michael. Your name is Michael, right? Yes, it is. Michael. What's your middle name? David. That is a rich name. Really? Michael David. I ain't rich. <laughs> yes. Would you like to start a clothing line with Michael David? That's a dope name. Yeah. Or my last name's Tree. Michael David Tree. Yes. <laughs> okay. So yeah, that's your contour and the highlight. So yeah, that's your contour and the highlight. I love it, Shamika. Yeah, that's pretty, Shamika. You look fierce on one side and dumb on the other. Yeah. You look like life is good and then life's not so good. Uh oh. <laughs> Would you like to try it on me? So this is yes. supposed. This is supposed to be. It's supposed to look like. That. Yes. It's great. Yours doesn't look like that. It's just been through the day. It's been a whole day. But you, but you can like it's visibly lighter than me. It's supposed well, to be. Well, you're, you're African American, to... like really. Yeah. <laughs> In real life, it's gonna contour this. That's what you're saying. It's going to die. I like it a lot. It's I'm gonna do. Um, let me grab one other thing. I'm gonna be right back. So, um, one of the things that I do in my spare time and that I really like to stay committed to is being committed to my church. My father is a bishop, um, a pastor, he's my leader, and I think accountability is a huge thing. And so one of the things that have kept me humble is working in the ministry. So you're going to get a glance of some of the things that I may randomly do. Um, but uh, one thing that I've learned about our generation, millennials, is that we're very intelligent, but a a lot of us are very uncommitted and it goes to show um, with the inconsistencies that we have with our brands, with our schooling, with relationships, marriage, how we, um, you know, parent our children and so forth. So here is me and my other best friend Courtney um, and Janaea, a childhood friend. We still have maintained a relationship as well and you're going to see us cleaning up after a meeting and um, there's this huge bucket and I'm like pouring the tea out we're supposed to clean up things so um, this is it and you're gonna wrap it up so this is you catching Kiara the life of me a bit different with the contrast and the uh, quality of things but here it is
We're currently going to attempt to put this tea into this bucket here. Let's see, hold on. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Go, <on>, tea! <laughs> Good job. There you have it, church girls doing church work. <laughs>